Previously on Cheer Hat. I called my friend Tara, who is a professional dancer and also a choreographer. We've been really working our dance lately, trying to beef it up a little bit, make it hit the score sheets. At the end of the day, we want to make the kids look their best, so we're just working together to do whatever we can for them. We only have one more practice until we leave for Hawaii. So if in 20 minutes we can't finish this dance and memorize this dance, then we're going to scratch it all and on, you're going back to your original dance. We're going to Hawaii in five days. I am so excited. We get to compete. This is like such an awesome opportunity for us. We just want to do good and make everyone proud. I got no it. pressure. Hey, kids. Hi. What are you guys working on? Oh, no. Bring it in. <laughs> so this is the last practice before we hit Hawaii. How do you guys feel? I'm excited. This is your national event. You got a full paid bid. So today's practice needs to be serious. No playing, no talking, because we don't have a lot of time. No pressure, but pressure. Okay? It's crunch time. You guys ready? All right, let's go. Let's do it. Go ahead. Pressure, but Wake up. This is our last chance to get to work with them before Hawaii. This is our last cheer hab practice ever before the season's over. And it's kind of sad, but I'm still excited and I hope it goes really well. This is important. It, it's their last test, you know, so it's important for them to succeed. All right, let's go from the very beginning. Do the two man with the double down. Uh, do the actual back handspring and stop on the clean on five. Three, ankles five, squeezing seven. Sit, one, two, three, and stop. We're going to redo it because Sarah didn't do it and we're falling out of our clean. Your clean is ankles is what? Together, arms pressed by your. Is this a clean? No. Strong, control. And redo. Next person to miss is standing back handspring. Everybody holds a push up. That person has 15 by themselves. This is a big deal because teams in Hawaii are generally really strong and very clean and technical. It's just a little bit added stress that makes you want to work and try a lot harder to make them happy. Let's go guys, it's crunch time. What do I need from you? To clean and stand up. To clean and stand up with no movement. Again, and stop blending stuff together, it's sloppy. Let's go from the beginning of the two back handsprings through the set of the stunt, doing the stunt. Uh, what's after the stunt section? Are we going to rebound off the ground? Are we going to be sloppy? Are we going to be ugly? And one, squeeze, three, up, five, step, eight, one, stop, stop. We're being messy. I don't, what is this clap? How do you go from being clean at one competition and back at hot diarrhea mess again? Let's go. We clap with our elbows together. We have, that was day one. Literally was the first thing we taught you. Press. And be super aggressive. It's getting really hard because a lot of the stuff that they're telling us, they've told us the first time they came here. Five, sharper, seven. Five, seven, squeeze. What did I say about rebounding after your jumps? Press into the ground, 20 push-ups, go, everyone. No one really worked on it that well, so now they're getting kind of angry because we have to go over everything again. If you're tired, I don't want to know you're tired. Your face tells all the story. One, and three, and four. Five, squeezing seven, point, one, three, lift, three, and four, five, seven, don't move. Hallie, what's the problem? I don't want to take this out. Okay, do we need to cancel this trip? Are we going to be big crybabies? It's one phone call away. Hey, we're declining the bid. We're not coming. Thank you. Click. Bye-bye. It's an invitation. You can take it or leave it. It's a privilege to go. Stop crying. The stunt's falling because of you. You're the one that's not catching the grip. So don't cry, fix it. Crying doesn't help anyone. Just slow it down on the way down, that's it. I don't wanna do this. So it's our last practice. There's two stunts that are not consistent on hitting. Everyone's really tired. How do you go from being clean one week to coming back and then it's like you're beating flies off of your face again? Like it would be stupid for them to go all the way to Hawaii and, and in last place. Don't move. Again. Jeez. Louise. Jeez Louise, I need some cheese. More sass, more flavor. Give me something to work with. And three, hit, five, hit, step, hit, squeeze. Stop moving. Still bouncing. Redo. Jump, bend, jump, bend, jump, squeeze. Again, there's still movement. You're blending the sections together. They're not defined sections. It looks crazy. Go back. Redo just for you. You guys are still moving whenever you want. You make this way harder on yourselves than it needs to be. I can see that it's not how hard you guys work on. Squeeze. Listen to them. Here. That shouldn't be happening at this time of year right now. Yeah, they're like. Go. 
like kind of breathe in between. That shouldn't be happening anymore. Everyone's getting tired, so it's just, it's getting a lot harder. Seven and one, three, redo. Let's go again. Too many mistakes. We had people not throwing passes, more than one. You cannot have your toes and your hands on the ground at the same time in a back handspring. That is falling. Understood? Dropping a stunt to the floor is falling. A fall is a fall. Come on. I know you're tired, but there's a time you gotta push. Squeeze. There's all you got. Let's go. Smile. Okay, don't smile. I'm not gonna count to everybody smiling. You wanna protest? I can protest. He's asking you to smile. Seven, eight, one, good. Three and four, five, up, seven, eight. Squeeze, five and seven, eight and one. And one, and on three, going five, and seven, and three, lifting five, and seven, and one, hold, good move, make sure your shoulder's shoulder in the center, breathe, good, go get some water, stretch your arms, breathe. Everybody that was part of that box that didn't throw two handsprings, get back on the floor, and go, now you have five. It's not a choice, it's part of your routine. Now do whatever you want, All-Stars. We're competing at a national championship. I mean, this is the biggest competition we're gonna be at all seasons. It's definitely stressful to have that on your shoulders. Thank you. Uh, hello, where are you going? You've done two. I'm crowning. Everybody hold the push up for Jesse. Let's go. You're gonna do two and walk away like it's not important? It is important. Ali, I got it. Your team is waiting for you. Get inside. Yesenia, what are you doing? You have a whole team waiting for you in a push-up, just so you know. Hurry. Well, it used to be me when I was in high school when I wouldn't throw my skill. My whole team had to hold a push-up or do 25 backhand springs. I know what it's like to feel bad for your team. I feel really scared because I feel like my team's giving up at this point. But I know we can do it. Yes. Now squeeze your arms and you stand. The next person I see, put their knee down on the floor. We hold a handstand on the concrete wall instead. Got it? Good girl. Good girl. We got three more. Lock. Lock. Oh. All right, I'll take it. Even though you touched out, I'll take it because you gave me heart. Go ahead, do what you got to do. Get a quick drink, Yesenia. And Jesse, get a drink too because I know you didn't get one. Go. It's much easier to throw one than to throw five, yeah? People are getting really stressed out and people are crying and all that things happen. And it brings a lot of the other teammates down when a lot of our strongest teammates are down. Are you ready? Pyramid. All the way to the end of the pyramid. Everything goes. Two times or 200 times, you pick. Last one. But it has to hit. If not, is first one of many. And go ahead and bring it in, kids. The rest of you. Bring it in, officer. Guys, is it easier to do things once or 10,000 times? Okay. Do you guys see when coach said last time and you screamed last time? That energy needs to be there all the time, not just on your last time. Does that make sense to you guys? Is this our last competition this season? You won't have the same exact team on Monday when we get back. That's it. It's your final goodbye. So let's end it that way. Let's not get lazy the last competition, the biggest one. It's like running a 26 mile mar marathon and the last 15 feet you decide to walk and everybody else runs in front of you. It makes no sense. It makes absolutely no sense. <laughs> last time these 20 friends are gonna be together on the floor. Very last time. So enjoy each other, enjoy these moments because you're never gonna get them back, ever. Ever, ever, ever. They wouldn't be here without me, I wouldn't be there without them. And I want those kids to go out there with the best routine of the season. Push for the seniors that won't cheer again. Push for this team one more week, that's all we're asking. Push the hell out of that week, and on a high note. Take that trophy, take those jackets. Don't just sit back and watch someone else say, excuse me, thank you, that's my jacket. <laughs> Understood? 
All right, we love you guys. We're out. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. X out of three. One, two, three. X out. Okay. Bye, guys. We'll see you in Hawaii. Bye. Peace love love. you guys. Work hard. Hey guys, thanks for watching. And don't forget to subscribe to Awesomeness TV.